Okay. I'm going to do a blog today, vlog, sorry, of my day at Lincoln Home. Should be a lot of fun. We're having a candlelight tours tonight. Let's just see how it goes. Hopefully it doesn't rain. This is the visitor center. My job today is tickets. Dave Lincoln's home right there. This is one of the most famous shots taken. Mr. Winkle, see if I can get a shot in there. Piggly Wiggly right here. Walk down here. This is the Dean House with Mr. Lincoln's neighbors. Sorry for the shoes. Speaking. I'm doing a video documentary. Oh. It's really thick uh, stems. It's called a what? A walking onion. And then when the stem is ready, the plant is ready, the top of the stem gets bulbs like this. Well, then these bulbs get bigger and bigger and heavier and heavier, and then the bulbs pull the stem down to the ground. And when the bulbs hit the ground, they root and they grow another plant. Oh. So this group of plants started in that corner. And you'll notice they're kind of marching to the east. Oh, so you didn't plant different ones, they just plant one and go down. Right. They just they worked their way down. Interesting. So we planted the original clump there. And it just keeps going this way for some reason. Did they have to replant these every year? Yeah. Uh, they're just like regular onions. They don't winter over. You take them up because there's, there's an onion bulb at the bottom. Not as big as our normal bulb, mm -hmm. because it's also producing these bulbs at the top. So you can eat these, or you save them for seed for next year. Dig it with this thing. Let me see if we get them. We get a tiller. <laughs> Dang, that is heavy. Isn't it? And this is what they did the tilling? No, this is what they turned the garden with. Men are they're all strong as oxes. Yeah. Why did they make them so heavy? Well, because the only thing they had was wood and iron. And iron, uh, 
is very is a very heavy metal. Yeah, pick up that rake on the way out. That's, that's another thing. Oh my god. Okay, that's why I didn't go into farming. Let's go inside the Dean house. <laughs> the Battle of Antietam and Sharpsburg, while well, this is going to be considered a tactical fall, no one really won, but, but President Lincoln was desperately seeking a win, because he was contemplating making a uh, proclamation or issuing a uh, executive order. Well, he considered this, since the troops, the Confederate troops left the field, they stopped the Confederate Campaign wagon, three days in the Winnebago. It's more of Lincoln home. No rabbit ears, I see that. If I could walk into the room. Yeah. <laughs> Too busy texting. Is that what's going on? Yeah.